Baby, you don't know what you do to me Between me and you, I feel a chemistry I won't let no one come and take your place Hello beautiful people, welcome back to another video So today I'll be doing a video about what's in my nursing bag So actually this is a lug bag and most people usually know it as a travel bag so you can find it one that is that looks like a handbag the one that looks like a backpack like it comes in so many varieties so i got this one that looks like a handbag and i prefer it because of the number of pockets like you have space to place everything that you need for a single shift you can use it either for day shift or night shift between that during night shift there's some other items that i'll add here but so this i've packed it for a day shift so if you'd like to get this bag you can check the link down below in the description box or in the comment section i'll leave the link for anyone who wants to get the lug bag yes so this here is just the front pocket so open you'll see that i have a place whereby you can place pens so here i can place my pencil red pen black pen blue pen then there's another pocket for like extra let's say books i usually put here my notebook or any stick notes that I might use whenever I'm on a shift. Then on this pocket also, I have a place that is like, I usually put makeup or not even makeup, just random things that you might need like lip gloss or lip balm or lotion. I usually carry a lotion because most of the time you wash your hands and most of these hospitals you find that they usually use this soap, this liquid blue soap that you usually sell uh, 20 shillings in those 500 ml bottles. So most of them they usually use that soap and it really dries your hands. So I like, usually prefer just to carry a lotion. So lotion and then right here I have a lip balm, a lip gloss, tissue paper handkerchief and some tic tac so these are just like for refreshment every time in time i'm going for kind of a break and i've washed my hands i'm going to sit down so you can just like at times wash your face face then use your handkerchief then apply lip balm apply lotion and you're good to go and also it comes with a mirror so this is the best part it comes with a mirror so you can just like pull it out and then you use the mirror just while applying the lip gloss or something they will just return it on that point then on these other two extra ones like you can place anything that you really want to get that's something that you always use each and every time and you really want to get it as fast as possible so that you don't have to open other pockets in here for you to get it so for me here I usually place the pulse oximeter and also the airpods the airpods come in handy because at times let's say there are no patients and you feel bored you can just have music on and just feel relaxed because you know times your nursing job can really get a little bit stressful and you just feel like even though wanna listen to people shouting you just want to like listen to music so the airpods come really handy because it doesn't look rude whenever you just whenever you have airpods on because you can cover them up with your hair or you can cover them up with the hat that you're having on but you know for earphones when you have earphones on and people see that car thing hanging everyone just thinks oh this person really like using their phone each and every time so for airpods you can just leave your phone in your bag and you're listening to music and no one knows yeah and then i also have the parts oximeter that having this as a nurse or a, as a clinical officer can really come in handy because you'll use it like let's say you have a patient and they come in with breathing problems and you want to check all the other things you can also use the pulse oximeter like which can really save you instead of having all the bigger machines like if you see a problem by using this that's why you think of the bigger machine so you can also get this pulse oximeter i'll leave a link down below you can also check it and you can get it for a really good price and then after this other ones we have another one right here so here i usually just place um the other hospital item so here i place a stethoscope a face mask and a hand sanitizer so hand sanitizer comes in handy although yes some hospitals usually have some hand sanitizer but some don't and at times maybe the hand sanitizer is just like as far away from the entrance so you have to go to the entrance to use the hand sanitizer so having yours can really come in handy and then a face mask yeah and then also a stethoscope so if you want to get the stethoscope the one i'm using is the litman so if you want to get it i also leave a link down below so that you can find it at a very good price so you can check the link down below and check it on amazon yeah 
before I get on the inside part let's first see the back of it because on the back it also has other pockets that's why I'm telling you it can be a really good bag even you can use it apart from traveling and apart from even as a nursing bag you can use it as a baby bag because imagine if you have baby items and you have all these side pockets like it is just amazing you know so on this back pocket there's a one that looks like a zipper and you know this is one that you won't be using it as much because it is on the back and you get me so i use this place to just place extra items so like right now what's inside here is just extra pads and extra panty liners just for emergency so those ones i just place it in the back of this bag yeah and then also in at the back here we have another pocket and this one usually kind of it has an inner part like it is it is just not like a pocket that is just like here like you can get are you getting me so here is where you can place uh your food items that you're carrying for that shift let's say you have food you have snacks you can just place them inside here so let me show you what i mean you see this pocket like it has an inner compartment so it can go like inside inside there until it comes below the other items that are inside the bag so you can use this to place any size of dish right now i have a smaller dish but you can use it to place any size of a dish even the bigger ones so you can carry your lunch you can carry fruits you just have to know how to arrange it so well yeah you can carry other snacks here and the type of material that is in here it is a kind of let's say cooler because there's a day i had ice cream in here and it really stayed for long it is a kind of cooler and also like it it is easy to clean and the material is the one which even if something pours you can just wipe it out and it's so easy here even the bag itself the material is so easy to just wipe out here and then now on the inner part you also have several pockets so there's this one here this is the place where i place my phone so i can have my phone here or any other item that i'm carrying that i really want it to be on the inside part i'll just have it on this pocket or on this other pocket then there are also other pockets here you can have pens extra pens or something yeah then another thing that i carry i either carry a notebook or a diary to, with me to work because like i usually plan a lot because i have a lot of stuff to do with planning and whatever and ever so i usually just like writing it down because i'm so forgetful so i usually have that with me and then also my pass where i have my id my license and all the like necessities that you just have to have with you whenever you're going somewhere whenever you're going out then on this other side i have a pocket that is just handy for a water bottle like my other water bottle is kind of huge so it cannot fit here so you can have any kind of bottle here there anyone that can fit you can just have it so right now i'm just having this simple water bottle right there then on this other side it's also a pocket so in this pocket you can just have other extra items it all depends with you with what you want to put. like there are a lot of pockets you can all decide what you have to put there so for me on this other side i have a it's a kind of notebook so the, here is where i usually have kind of clinical notes these clinical notes i made them myself like i just printed out a list of things that i think were important for you to have when going to work like here yeah, normal vital signs mm, i also made a list of like normal labs lung sounds normal abg values normal ranges for like hemoglobin the bbc's all those kind of things also made a list of glass block coma scale and also pharmacology like the antihypertensives antibiotic and um what else endocrine system the rules of nine cranial nerves just like small tiny items that can come in handy whenever you are in the hospital especially if you're a nursing student this can really come in handy i thought of starting this by creating them in a way that i can even laminate sell it out but yeah i'm really not not sure about that yet i'm really working on that so i was thinking of doing that and creating these clinical notes so they can come in handy especially for the nursing students here yeah. 
so yeah that's it for my nursing bag i hope you guys liked it and see you on my next video bye bye